What's up, YouTube? It's Team Knife Party here, and we have Paul Murillo. Just got top 16 and best in red 2015 regional. Um, how do you feel about your last match? It was nobody's fault but mine. I was honest and told him, um, heck, I accidentally shuffled my discard pile, and it was up to the judges from there. But the board state was pretty much in my favor. I would have won the game, essentially, but things happen. I got you, man. Well, at least you're not, you know, salty about it. So, nothing um, I can do about it. All right, man. Well, thanks so much. Uh, if you want to go ahead and get into the deck real quick, go ahead. He played Red Goku. Crazy, right? I know. So, <laughs> so I play Super Saiyan God Goku. Um, reason being, I get an extra draw when I do a shoulder grab combo. Power stages are, heck, I mean, I can knock down Krillin or Ginyu turn one and attempt to, you know, advance the level turn one or turn two. Um, pretty much, yeah, he's a staple in my deck. Goku level two is not that great. Goes up to C. My max at the attack table is three. Um, at the end of combat, I can get a drill or I can go down a level, or I can do both. Level three, energy attack for five. Can get a setup or drill for my discard pile and play it. Uh, hit, I can rejuvenate it to five drills. A lot of orange Goku characters know how to use that in him well. And then Goku, get up to five drills. The combo with him is to get tactical drill, forward stance drill, embarrassing drill, and two other drills that seem fit for the matchup. All right. So, um, red of course, the beautiful red mastery. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you very much. And then uh, let's get into the actual deck. So go ahead and uh, just run through. Physical combat is going to be three shoulder grabs. For remainder combat, our attacks are considered to be critical damage. If you don't have time or black power up, blinding energy move, this would destroy a lot of decks. Uh, double strike, attack table stages, raise your anger one. This is basically four anger after a shoulder grab, so this two card just levels you up. Three red heel kicks, you raise your anger one. This is basically a dulled version of red axe heel kick from the old game. You lower your anger two to get a red style attack, place it in your hand, so I usually get red uh, double strike. And then if I have Embarrassing Drill, I can make that zero so I get a free Anger off of that. Um, and just combo from there. Three red slides. What this card does is my drills aren't discarded when changing levels this combat. So it's kind of a mini Orange Mastery in a way. But I have to time this because if I'm at four Anger and I advance, my drills will still get discarded. So I kind of have to play this when I'm at three Anger. Uh, mule kick, wall break answer. Two red right punch. This card's pretty amazing. Um, based on your anger, you get to search that many drills. So I'm at four anger, I can search for four drills. If I'm at five anger against blue, I can search for five drills, which lets me thin out the deck for less non combat. Uh, two red shattering leaps. That's an interesting card. I've never seen red players really use that one. So I utilize this card because it attack table plus four hit. You raise it. You can use it again. It costs a stage, which is fine. But after, if you have a double strike and shattering leap, you're gonna do a lot of damage. Um, two red knee lifts. This is. Answers for Ginyu and Piccolo. You can take Dragon Balls or Anger. Oh, you yeah, play crit, you play crazy. exactly. Uh, you play Shoulder Grab. This is essentially three crits from here. And then for my block, it's going to be three red blocking hits. Nice. That's a lot of physical combats. Uh, does that make up the majority of your deck? Uh, yeah, it does. Um, let me go to my my energies. Okay. So I play three red static shot. This card red dig. is the original dig. <laughs> I usually start off with this card and be aggressive with the physical 
combat cards because once they're at zero, I'm gonna beat them down and just do a million stages to them. Mm -hmm. um, plus, this is three anger right here, so this is a staple for red. Uh, three red freezing beams. Not a lot of red p players use this, but what this does is I can search my discard pile or banish zone for a drill and place it in a play, which is really nice so I can combo and get threatening drill back or saving drill back. And then red energy blast for the Ginyu hate and problematic drills. Right. Did it ever bother you that you could hit a setup with it? It setups aren't that big of a deal to me unless it's like Dragon Radar and it's crucial they're gonna ball two. But other than that, setups doesn't really bother me because I have board wipe. Okay. Uh, and then for my blocks it's gonna be three red sacrifice. Okay. How often did you uh block with that or did you usually ditch it? Um, I block with it a couple times, um, but generally I can uh, level up, get to anger, and heck, when you're in the crit when you're doing critical damage effects, like nothing, then heck, there you go. Yeah. Uh, drill lineup, I play Red Threatening Drill. Okay. This card's not being really utilized right now, but it will in the future. Mm. Um, all your attacks do plus one stage of damage, which isn't great. But when I advance the person personality level, all my styled physical attacks do plus three. So if I lead off with dig, I mean um, static shot, it hits. I can banish this. All my physical they're gonna do plus three. Plus my attack table is really good. And heck, I'm gonna be doing 20, 30 life cards just in physical uh, combat cards. That's crazy. Uh, more damage uh, modification is going to be red despair drill based on my anger. It does X amount of life cards. So I'm at, let's say I do, you know, a physical attack. I raise an anger, it's going to do three life cards or whatever I'm at. Lookout drill, good against the Mechian, um, good against uh, Visage. I run it, I think it's a staple card. Red saving drill. This is uh, basically red, red and meditation drill from the old game, but a little dull down. But anyways, this um, I banished this when changing levels, and my drills are saved. Uh, red embarrassing drill. I can use this with uh, heel kick or um, horse dance drill. I essentially have a block every turn. Right, because this says you have to lower your anger. Yeah, and then, and then since this is a lightning effect, this happens before this. Right. And then I play two red tactical drills. Just so they can't lower your anger? If they can't lower my anger, they can't. They won't be able to win unless they do a lot of uh, life card damage. Right. I run two just in case one gets banished. I can search out another one with Goku level two, or maybe if it's a discard pile, I can get it from Goku three. Okay. But how many drills is that? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight drills. Eight drills. Seven different names. Seven different names. Okay. Do you ever uh, run out of drills, per se? Like, uh, if you get to level 4 Goku, or...? No, I always have 5 drills okay. in play. Uh, setup's gonna be 3, Relaxation. That's amazing. <laughs> amazing card. Uh, you gotta set up your graveyard just when to... When printed that, they were like, red, we, we got you. Yeah, we got you, basically. Um, this right here, heck, wins games. You can manipulate your graveyard to have the card you want at the bottom, and you can just uh, enter combat from there, knowing what you have in your bottom of your discard pile, and, a free crit and what effect. you draw, and a free crit. That's crazy. Um, I play two red blazes. Only two, not three? Just two. Um, I can get it back with Goku level three, which is why I only play two. Okay. Um, pretty much this is heck, free two anger. Right. And then everyone knows what visiting does. Right, staple, staple. in the deck, in any deck. Uh, they get uh, they ever get clogging during combat? You know, you draw and do you ever draw too many setups? No, not generally. I mean, it's pretty. Uh, my deck's pretty balanced right now, which is what I like. Um, before I used to run a lot of setups and drills, but I figured let me be a little more aggressive, and I got rewarded for being a little more aggressive. Okay, and then the last thing is just the events. Lesson is going to be so, time, time course, staple, spheres. Spheres, all right, two, amazing cards. Two confrontations. So once again, only two? Just two. Okay, so it's uh, is this because you opted for more combat as well? Just more combat, yeah. Okay.
uh, red authorization, obviously board wipe. I'm not a, I'm not scared to wipe my own board because I'll get everything back at level four. Okay, that makes sense. And then my omni block. Three red, red stop as well. Three red stops. I can lower my anger to get a style drill from my graveyard or bandage zone. And right. So the uh, the red Ginyu guy actually played this, but uh, you seem to make more use of it than he did simply because you can go grab a drills, right? Exactly. I can lower my anger one. Uh, let's say they do blue betrayal on tactical drill. I can play this, lower my anger to get tactical drill back, which basically did nothing. Okay. So. And that's the deck. That's the deck. All right. So. Uh, how do you how do you feel just overall? Nothing right now, matters. like I said, I'm just really mad at myself. I could have made you know top eight, possibly top four. Um, hey, I just want to do good for my card shop, and there we go. That's pretty much it. All right, at man. Well, I... thank you so much. Um, once again, I do appreciate the deck profiles. And even if you lost top 16, man, you know what? At least now you proved, you know what? You're the best in red. At least I'm best in red. Exactly. There we go. All right, man. So, uh, this is Team Knife Party signing out, guys. Um, Remember to comment, like, and subscribe if you like the video. So, uh, see you guys later.